multiple agencies searching for a four-year-old. Heidi, Todd, look at these pictures. Disappeared on Johns Island outside of Charleston just before 6 o'clock last night. Now, police say Heidi's mother was found brutally beaten at their home, and that's when they discovered this little girl Heidi was missing. The mother told authorities Heidi may be with a Hispanic man in his 20s, and in the last hour, police released the sketch on the right of your screen of a person of interest. Charleston police, FBI, numerous state agencies have been searching for Heidi all day looking in ponds, unfortunately, and surrounding areas with a helicopter. Let's go to Brianna Smith with the latest on that investigation. Hey, Gordon, while the search for Heidi Todd has been furious, details about what led up to her disappearance are still fuzzy as investigators piece together information. By boat and by air, the search is on for missing four-year-old Heidi Todd. Uh, but it's very important we get Heidi back, and I want to echo what the mayor said, that that's our focal point right now. Charleston police were called by a school district yesterday when Heidi's mom didn't pick up her kids at school. Police found the mother beaten brutally inside her home and Heidi missing. At present time, we're trying to unravel the entire motive, leaving no stones unturned, trying to determine exactly what occurs. Police say an unwanted guest hurt the mother and is described as a skinny Hispanic man in his 20s. Police still aren't sure if Heidi is with this man or not. They released this sketch of a person of interest just an hour ago. But with no more answers, the FBI, Charleston police, and state agencies will continue to search for Heidi until she's found. There are many things that we do not know yet that we are still investigating, but there's one thing that we know. And that is that Heidi Todd is missing. And we need everyone to be on the lookout. So, Gordon, we just got an update as well. They say that the pond is clear. They're pretty confident that Heidi is not in that pond. They've expanded the search, though, and also increased the reward to $20,000. A woman was beaten. Yes. A child is missing. They're asking for everyone's mm -hmm. help. How come I haven't seen an Amber Alert on this? Those questions were asked all day by our reporters down in Charleston. The answer came from the mayor who said that because they didn't know if Heidi was with this person of interest, they didn't know if she was taken in a car or if she wandered out of her home, that that's the reason why that Amber Alert wasn't issued. But it seems like every time we have a press conference about a missing child, we get different answers about why those Amber Alerts weren't on. So we plan on looking into this deeper as well. It's a top priority. All yeah. right, Brianna, thank you. You can look at that picture again by heading to WSPA.com.